So we have um, a couple of hoop houses that we use to extend our vegetable season. So, um, which is how we're able to do a share that starts in April and also go through November is we can have fresh greens that whole time through using the hoop houses. And one of our hoop houses is um, actually movable. So it's on tracks and can actually move from one location to another location. So one way that uh, Susan, who I bought the farm from has always use cover crops is by cover cropping the half of the tunnel that is not currently in use in order to um, restore the fertility and prevent erosion in that section while the, the greens that we grow in the high tunnel are in the other section. And that's particularly important in the high tunnel because we grow, um, that space is very valuable. High tunnels are expensive and um, so we want to really maximize the use of that infrastructure on the farm. And so um, we plant really intensively. Um, we try to, when we harvest a crop from the high tunnel, replant it in about 24 hours. So there's always something being planted there, which is a little different than the, the other vegetable fields. And so the cover crop really helps us make sure that we're restoring the nutrition to that section of the, of the high tunnel so then when we move the high tunnel back on top of it a year later it's ready to be planted in the same way again we've been specifically using hairy vetch um, sometimes in combination with other things like oats um, depending on the time of year uh, because it's a legume to try to to uh, fix some nitrogen in that section we have a cover crop planted here now and then the hairy vetch will fix the nitrogen um, and hold the soil, add some good organic matter, and we will till it in um, right before we move the high tunnel in late summer uh, before we plant our fall greens. So this is what uh, the high tunnel looks like when it's in full production. We have seven beds of different types of greens and um, like for, here, for example, you can see that we just harvested this for our spring delivery this week, and we'll turn it over and plant it again really quickly. Um, so the high tunnel has a lot of like nut nutritional demands um, to do that sort of back-to-back -back planting. Um, and so all of these will be harvested for our spring and early summer shares. And then we'll keep doing that through the beginning of the summer and then and the late summer, we will actually slide this whole high tunnel downhill to where the hairy vetch cover crop was, and this side will get to go into a cover crop.